Hello, let's continue our Sudoku adventure with Seven Trippy <laughs> by Matt Tressel. So uh, we have normal six by six Sudoku rules, meaning in each row, each column, and each two by three box, we are placing the digits one to six exactly once each. We also have these seven trippy lines. Um, it's, it's like entropic lines or modular lines, if you've done those before. It's the same concept. It's just the groupings are different. So in this case, every three adjacent digits on a line. So these three and these three, these three and these three and these three and these three, every group of three adjacent on the line have one of each from a group. So there's three groups and we need one of each in, in, uh, in every three. So this has one of each, this has one of each, this is one of each. In this case, the groups are the digits that add to seven. So one, six, two, five, and three, four are three groups. So for example, if I put a one here, then this group of three um, can't have another one or six because we need to fulfill the other two groups. So I could do one, two, and three. Those are three of our groups. Or I could do one, five, and four. Or I could even do six, five, and four, or six, two, and four, right? But I need one of each from the groups. And then this would also need one of each, and this would also need one of each, etc. All right, so those are the seven trippy lines. Uh, we also have our x's and v's. v is the Roman numeral for 5, so these two add to 5. It tells us the sum of the touching digits. And the x, uh, that's the Roman numeral for 10, so they sum to 10. And that's it. Those are the rules. There's a link in the description if you'd like to try the puzzle yourself. And I'm going to get started right now. All right, 10 is always 4, 6 um, in a 6 by 6. It's the only way we're adding to 10. And that 4, 6 is looking down here, telling us this can't be 1, 4. Would you use the 4? So this has to be 2, 3. Um, okay, and then these are these are the 1, 2, 3, and 4, which I am, I'm shamelessly going to mark, um, because that makes this a 5, 6 pair. Um, you can't put 5 or 6 on a sum to 5. It doesn't work. So um, let's talk about the 7 trippy here. So 5 and 6 are... are um, already represented here. So that's the 1, 6 group and the 2, 5 group. So we need the 3, 4 group represented in this group of 3. So this has to be 3, 4, and also in this group of 3. So this has to be 3, 4. So that's a 3, 4 pair. So that tells me that neither of these are from the 3, 4 group. Like th these are from the, the 1, 2, uh, 5, 6 groups, right? So that tells me we need both this and this to have a 3, 4. Yeah, there's a 3, 4 over here. But we can't have both of these be three, four. Yeah, I mean we know that already. But all right, I'm trying to trying to find the logic as we go. Uh, four and six being gone. Okay, so think about this. This group, but I think I think coloring here might help a little bit. So this group, if but we don't know what the green group, purple group, or orange group is, but we know there are the these represent all three groups. And so what you end up having is in an entropic line, or I guess an, a seven tropic line. <laughs> Um, you end up having a cyclical nature because if these three have one of each, now these three also need one of each, but they already have the purple and orange. And the only three groups are green, purple, and orange. So this has to be different than purple and orange. It has to represent the green group. So these two are the same group. And we already have lost one from, we've already lost the four and the six. So this has to be a two five pair. It's the only choice. We don't know which ones of these are the. Uh, are the one and the uh, three, but we know that's also a one three pair. So I don't really need to color that, but one three pair looks over here, removing the one and the one three from here, and the two five pair removes two five from here and the two from here. So we can do two three or four one. This can't be a four. Um, all right. This has a similar property, but we don't know what these two are. Oh, we have a two, three pair here, though. So this we know is four, six, and two, three. We know this is one, five. And so this group here has to be whatever's not the one or the five group. So it has to be from three, four. And that makes a pair. And then this is going to be whatever the... So if I were to color this briefly, this here is going to be whatever the other green is. And so if green is 1, then this has to be 6. If green is 5, then this has to be 2. Oop, whoa, that's not what I meant to do. That has to be 2. So I'm going to uncolor that again, because I don't think we need the colors yet. Um, so 2, 6 does not seem to do much for me. 
Um, I was looking to see if we were missing any digits from here, but no, we have the one, two, three, four, five, six represented. Okay, I want to color this line here. So let's just cycle it. Um, these are both orange. That's interesting. So is there something keeping it from being uh, one, six? I don't think so. Okay, it means none of these are orange. That's interesting. So that means these are both orange. Ooh, that's a good deduction. Let me explain why, uh, just in case that's unclear. We know, we know we've used up both oranges for this column. So need, none of these are orange. But this group of three is going to need an orange in it. So this has to be orange. And this group of three needs an orange in it, but it can't be here or here. So this has to be orange. So we know that orange is the uh, orange needs to, this needs to be one or three. This needs to be one or five. Um, because three would have to go with four, and this can't be four, this can't be a three, making it a one. And now this also has to be a one, because five doesn't go with one. And so now we know that this is the one six pair, and that gives us the, the two, the five, three, and two here. It gives us the five and four here. It gives us the three and four here, the six and five. All right, I feel like I probably should have colored this first, but it is what it is. We also know this is green. We know green is two or three. So this is a two, no. Uh, Sorry, green green is is not the one six. I guess is all we can say from that. All right, um, I don't know if I want to continue coloring or or for good here. Um, I mean, we, we know one six two three. Yeah, let's. I don't think we need the colors. Anyway, one six two three. What's left is four five. And so this is. Oh yeah, we know what this is as well. This is three six. Yeah, so that's the three and that's the six, and that makes it this the one and this is the two. I think, I mean, this is from two, three, four, five, but let's let's get rid of the colors. I don't know if that we need them right now. All right. Um, one, two, three, four, one, two, five, six, and two are gone. What's kind of our next step here? We know we need two, five, and then a four, six up here. Do I need to think about? This entropy. Oh, these are the same entropy. So we know this is the one six group. It can only be one or six. And so this has to be the six. It can't be one. So that's six and that's one. Remember, these are the same because of our group of three requirement. That's four and six. That's two and three. That makes this a one four pair and this a two five pair, leaving behind the three and the six. So we know that this is the same as these two. No, that's not right. Uh, I have to color it again. This is the same as this. Same group. And this is three or six. So three would go with four. Six could not go with five. And five couldn't go with three or six. Yeah, so this has to be the three, four. So that's three and four. Okay. And that makes this five and two. It makes this one, four, six, one, three, six, two, five. Up here, we need the four and the five. That's five, four, and we're done. All right, neat puzzle, Matt. Um, I don't think I've seen seven trippy before, <laughs> but yeah, I mean, you can basically do it with any grouping you'd like, as long you know, uh, as a setter. Um, so yeah, cool to see some creativity with the groups. It was very easy to remember the groups because they added to seven, so that was nice. Cool. Well, let me know how you did. If you enjoyed this, why not leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below.